are in the biggest transformation of automotive history. We need to build systems that are actually safer than a human driver. And that brings us to the main purpose of the autonomous. A single company alone cannot master this challenge in the best possible manner. If you want to make a difference at very large scale, you have to bring the leaders together around a common platform that can enable everyone. As we're now introducing also vehicles which don't require a human driver, safety is paramount for us when we talk about deployment of AV technology. We need a safety discussion that goes into some really deep topics. What are the biggest challenges of a mass market autonomy? We identify four major design principles for a safe system. Regulation on L4 is not thinkable without collaboration. In the working group, we brought together a lot of different great minds out of the academia, out of the industry, we worked on the report, marvelous feedback. And the goal would be to bring out the second release at the main event next year. We prefer to talk about the 4SDV because we say it's about systems, it's about safety, it's about security and software defined vehicles. It needs to be seen in a broader context. We overestimate the next two years and we underestimate the next 10 years. I have the wish that we work as seamlessly and fluently together to create the additional expertise which we can get out of this group. The only way how we're really going to get that public trust, both from the general public and from the governments, it's going to make sure that we are moving all together into the same direction. We all spend the time together to build bridges, global bridges between continents and between different industries. The conference is one of a kind. It's the place to bring together innovators, manufacturers and even regulators to discuss the future of autonomous driving. And that already shows that we can only do it together. Nobody can do this alone. We must team up and have the opportunity to work together to find solutions for the future mobility. We used the last five years to really build up this international ecosystem. And we're going to use the next five years to really support the industry in moving on their journey towards full autonomous mobility. That's why we're here.